In this video, I'm going through the UART use case for MCC Melody, printf with variable counter. So I have a Curiosity Nano for the PIC18F Q41, but the principles that I'm going to show you here getting started with the UART are the same whether I'm using PIC or AVR. So new project. And I'll open MCC. We'll select Melody. This piece might take a little longer the first time you run it. Okay, so <coughs> under drivers, I'll find a UART, which you can add to my project. immediately here I can click on the question mark for the UART driver and open the driver documentation. In this video we are running the first use case but we'll click on the UART general code instructions first. Add a UART and configure as described. Generate a code snippets and program the board. So here we just um, print out hello world so we select a UART dependency selection for the UART connected to the serial CDC port and redirect standard I.O. to UART. So now you'll basically find the schematics of whichever board you're using. We can see that on the pick the selection doesn't matter. We can use any, any particular UART, although what is important is the selection of RB7 for the TX. For an example, AVR board, we see that the UART number does matter. It's UART3. And again, we have specific pins PB0 for the TX. So for this particular pick, we select any UART. And the TX pin RB7. Now we wanted to redirect printf to UART. So the configuration done, we generate. Now let's look at the code snippets. We see the include is just the default. Copy the print loop code snippet to our clipboard and note that we just call this a certain number of times. So in our project, Finding main, place our code snippet near the beginning. We don't need any of this interrupt setup code. And let's call this a lucky number seven times. Compile. When all looks good, we can open the data visualizer. You can see that the default data visualizer COM port settings match our default COM port settings on the MCC Melody UART. We click to display in the terminal and program the part. The result is our hello world seven times as expected. 